Hey guys, so I just filmed a tutorial. I filmed the tutorial on these nails. I love these nails. This was requested by Makeup. I'll have her channel link down below. She makes really fun videos. So thank you so much, Bianca, for requesting the video. I am so sorry about my appearance. I look like crazy. I don't even know. It's late right now. The lighting is going to be a little bit weird. I really like my lip color. I have some acne. I tried to cover it. Whatever. We're going to keep going. Um, Candy nail art. Little candies and polka dots. So I show you guys how to create that. But before we begin... Um, these are the polishes that I used. For my base color, I use Color Club's Gift of Sparkle, Essence Color and Go in Breakthrough, L'Oreal's Fuzzy Bruche, Revlon Posh, and Revlon Sassy, OPI Rumples Wiggin, a mini one, this is called Here's Jack. How I got these super cute candy nails, then please keep on watching guys. <laughs> And you're going to need your nails and paint the base coat a sparkly purple. That's what I did for mine. I'm taking a plastic tray and I'm going to be putting down some white nail polish. I like to put it on a plastic tray just because it's easier to work with when it's on a plastic item. And I'm going to be taking a dotting tool and that white polish and just dotting random dots all over this nail. And the reason I'm using white is so that the colors will stand out more. Um, when I go to do the colors, they'll stand out more. So, yeah. Moving on to the second nail, I'm going to be taking that same white polish and a dotting tool and putting dots just at the tip to begin with. And starting on the third nail, what you're going to do is take that white polish again and you're going to paint different candy shapes. I painted three different ones um, and they don't have to be perfect either. I just did a circle and after filled in the circle and then I did just little triangles going off the side to create the wrapper. And again, the reason I'm doing white is so that the color will stand out more. But these are actually really easy to create. Um, and if you don't have dotting tools, you can also use toothpicks or bobby pins. Um, but I'm going to link a link. I'm going to have a link for you down below. And you can get them at like Amazon, I think. And again, my camera would not focus for the life of me, so I apologize for that but I think you can get the gist of it, I hope. Okay, now I'm taking that plastic tray again and filling it up with my color palette. There's orange, purples, and greens like you saw before. I have two shades of each color, even though the oranges look similar and I put way too much green down, but it's whatever. You don't really need that much polish and you kind of want to work fast when this happens when you do this because the polishes tend to dry on the top and then they get goofy so just try and work a little fast i'm going over those dots with colors um just sporadically again with my different purples and greens and oranges moving on to this nail i'm basically doing the exact same thing and it's okay if you you know let some of the white show through. I think that even makes the look even better, just having some of the white show through. And I'm wiping it off on this paper towel, so that's why it started to get messy. <laughs> and now I'm taking the lilac shade and kind of trailing it down to the cuticle part of my nail. And then I'm going in with some other colors and smaller dots. I thought this just added to the nail and made it look a little bit put together. I don't know. I just like the way it came out. That kind of just went through. And for some reason my camera did not film me filling in the candy with colors. But yeah. So here it is. I think it's super, super cute. I love it so, so much. And I hope you guys do too. 